So with the holidays coming up, there's a lot of us that are stressed because we are going to be around some like family members and sometimes that can bring up some anxiety, especially if like you're on a spiritual awakening journey and not everybody is on that same wavelength because a lot of times if we were like a different person a couple years ago, like our family members and people that are close to us, like hold that narrative of us if they're not on a spiritual awakening journey. They see the old us. Because people don't understand what your internal experience is. Okay. Like you know how much growth you've done. <laughs> Even if it's on the outside or the inside. Okay. And you know where you're going. You see the vision. We move it forward. This is also a gentle reminder that part of being a light worker is to trigger the shadows within others. So you may have soul contracted <laughs> to come here and be the way shower, the light bringer, the transmuter, the breaker of generational trauma. Okay. And I know it's not always a fun job. <laughs> But you are making shifts within your family dynamics. I like to call us the rainbow sheep. So sometimes when we hold this perspective, we can have a little bit more of a compassionate eye not to excuse behavior if somebody's mistreating you. Okay, and not holding boundaries and all of that. <laughs> but sometimes we are very triggering to people because we're trying to stay in our light. We're trying to keep high vibe, high frequency. We don't want to get in negative like drama conversations. Like we just don't want to do it, okay? We can still stay strong in here in our fortitude, in our strength, in our courage of being that light bringer, okay, <laughs> while still holding a compassionate eye of obviously they're not on the same wavelength and that's their journey. We cannot force anyone to change. We focus on ourselves and the things around us change. It's like if you're with somebody and they're like super high vibe, positive, bubbly, excited, usually like you <laughs> You get, try and get up on that same wavelength, right? But if somebody's being like super negative and just like spiraling out of control <laughs> or drama city, you got to watch yourself. Are you going to get sucked back into that over the holidays? <laughs> or are we going to keep it pushing and keep it moving forward?